Hi, welcome back to Metal Rules TV, where the underground the meets the, the playground. Slap. The cock slap. Oh, Seth, it's getting harder. Seth, Seth MacFarlane will not be hosting the AVN Awards. No. The adult video news. Yes, you guys he was going to. I know exactly. The, the porn Oscars. Yeah. His reps say he's a little busy right now. Yeah. With Oscars, among other things. Yes. Instead, the 2013 awards will be hosted by porn stars Jesse Jane, mm -hmm. Jesse Jane, and Asia Akira. Oh, Akira! Oh, no. she sounds Asian. No, no, it's it's Asa Akira. I think. Is it A S A? Yeah. She sounds Asian. Yeah, she is Asian, but that's oh. awesome. That's gonna be a good show. I'm gonna actually go watch that. I've never hey, seen Asa, it. Asa, see, Asa, I told you, I didn't even read it. I've know. never seen the uh, ABN Awards. Oh no? Yeah. Man, it's pretty good. Yeah. I was at a porn convention. Uh, a bunch of years back. How was it? It was pretty neat. It's 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 a regular video convention mm -hmm. in Atlantic City in the convention hall, and all the regular. It, it's you're supposed to own a store or something. That's how you're supposed to get it. You can't just like walk in. Right. So I just made up a store name. You know, Freedom Rock and Video. You know, remember? <laughs> rock, remember? Turn it up. Is that Freedom Rock? Turn it up. Turn it up. Turn it up. So it's Freedom Rock and Video. So I went in there and I met a couple of my friends down there, and it's funny because the video convention where all the videos are, not so many people. Porn convention, that's where everyone is. And it's like roped off by curtains. And basically you go in there and it's like nerd central. These guys with big cameras like interviewing girls. But they don't work for anybody. They're going to go home and watch they're, it. And yeah. They're, they're, they're on my pants. They're right. making porn right. chicks on their own. But they're all around. Like it was. See, I'm with Metal Rules TV, so let me do an interview. Like you could directly do that. But that's not what they were doing. Um, but there was everybody yeah, there. Yeah, and yeah, it was... Yeah, yeah. I went like 10 years ago or something, and so the, the relics were still in the business. Like Nina Hartley was there, and Vanessa Del Rio, she oh, was wow. there. Yeah, so, um, and then, um, oh, what's the one who's uh, got really popular? The blonde. She was all. Jim Jameson? Thank you. Oh. She had a mob around her. Yeah. And yeah. it was really funny because I'm like, I'm not going to go wait in the mob. Like, you know, yes. they're like, take your top off. And she's like, you've all seen me make it more than anybody. You really, yeah. you know. But I met some people there. It was pretty neat. And some of the, uh, Shawn Michaels uh, and a couple of the people uh, were there. It was kind of neat. It was kind of neat to actually see them live. Not that they were thespians, but... Yeah. Yeah. But it yeah, was, it was stars neat. after Porn stars in the raw. We were Ron Jeremy. I got a picture of Ron Jeremy. Yeah, he was talking about Monster Man. He's kind of an asshole. Yeah, he's kind of... He's kind of uh, he came across like an asshole to you, he, he, he thinks he's funny, but he's not. But like you're like, oh my God, Ron Jeremy. He's like, yeah, hey, how you doing? Yeah, he's kind of a dick. I thought he was kind of a dick when he I was a little... Him. I'll tell you what, though. On a side thing, I met Shawn Michaels, which is just a big black guy. And yes. He's been in a bunch of movies, like all three eighties, and he was talking. I'm like, oh, he was just kind of by Blacks himself. Black and Blondes. Isn't he in that series? I, he might be in that one, <laughs> but he's just been in everything. You just seen him forever. So he was talking to uh, Asian Noir, G uh, um, Am uh, Amber Lynn, Ginger, Ginger Lee, fucking Ginger right. Lee. She was there. And I'm like, hey, Michelle Michaels, he's saying, what's up? And he's talking. He came back and he's like, hey, I'm sorry. And that's Ginger Lynn. You know, I'm going to meet her later. I'm like, yeah, I don't blame you. He's like, hey, what's going on, man? He shook my hand. He's like, oh, can I get a picture? He's like, oh, absolutely. He was just, I mean, it was just, he was like a really super guy. He was just like, hey, that's cool. He was a nice coxman. He's a nice coxman. Yes. <laughs> There's honor amongst the Yes, players. yes, there was honor. So it was pretty good. And uh, that was it. So um, it was interesting. I definitely uh, was worth the trip down there. And, um, what do you think about Seth MacFarlane uh, hosting the Oscars? I think it's going to be pretty good. I think he's a funny guy. I like yeah. the show. Yeah. He, he, he um, will turn it into an entire the uh, musical because he like seems. It. I've seen him do things outside of mm -hmm. Family Guy. Right. And I've seen him do the roasts, and he's pretty good on that. Yeah, so. yeah, uh, yeah. But I've seen him do some other things where he's like, "Hey, we're going to do stuff," and it just kind of goes on and on, and, and the musical end of it, and I don't find it that funny. Like when the guys for Trey Parker and Matt Stone from South Park do something outside of South Park, I don't find it funny at all. Right. Like the movies, baseball. Like baseball. Yeah, yeah, it's it for that. You know what I mean? So I don't know. I guess it'll be good for that stupid thing. It's probably anything's good. Well, that's what we got on South Park. Yeah, it's probably going to be better than Billy Crystal doing it, you know, again. Uh, 15 years in a row. Oh, God. Yeah. Not again. Yeah. So.